Well, found another one to save from the dump. Supposedly the story on this was uh, property was purchased and this was still in it. So she's uh, kind of maybe in an abandoned house kind of situation. Sure kind of looks like it. I was told it was already plugged in and powered up and actually had snow. So I'm just going to do that before getting into going through it and checking out the electronics. So let's see what happens here. We blow up or make smoky or whatnot. From what I've been able to tell real quick, I looked at the, the model number there that... Oh, I think it's uh, 75 or 76. Don't really know what we're going to find out. Well, let's see what happens. Well, I hear high voltage and I hear static. So, that's a plus. And static. I'll be damned. She looks real blue on the camera. Kind of looks blue in person, but not like that. I don't know, does that look blue to you, Joey? Uh, it looks normal in person, but on camera it's more blue, like you said. Yeah. It, uh, it is starting to look more and more normal that's sitting here. Well, that's cool. Want to plug in the converter box real quick? Yeah. I huh. think after it warms up a bit, it'll be just fine. Than this. Ooh. That's cool. All kinds of controls. There we go. That sounds awesome. Watching that come back to life after that. Yeah, well, you got it. Ooh, there we go. No color though. Maybe that's why this was retired. Color level. Oh, that's a lock. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Every campfire. Airport run. School play. Girls weekend. And every date night. Every journey matters. So does the battery that powers each These things be cleaned up. Oh, that's the brightness control. Yep. Looks like the color circuit's not working. Does your business need quick competitive financing for heavy machinery, trucks, or other equipment? Current is here to help. Whether you're financing construction equipment, farm equipment, trucks, but for the most part it's working. Just need color, don't we? Takes loans for up to five hundred thousand dollars with repayment terms seventy two months. Ooh, I it's gotta clean these controls. Easy and free to use. This holiday season, WeatherTech offers a variety of amazing gifts for everyone. Please your measure for Couldn't help myself, I had to pull the cover off of this thing tonight and have a look in here. I'm really happy to see there's no corrosion. However, look at this masterpiece. This it's just so cool. So awesome. And so amazing. Hand built. Uses some of the best stuff you can get. Absolutely incredible. I would have been so proud to work on this, make this TV, own this television back then. Uh, from the little bit I could find out, I think this is a 1975 set. So this is still when they were, you know, going at it by hand. <clears throat> Tuner shield's missing. He's had a little bit of work, maybe. What are we doing here? I won't zoom. There we are. But what was it? 78, 79? When Zena started cost cutting, sending jobs overseas. 
when the quality goes in before the name goes on kind of disappeared. Oh, there we are. So what we got here, I want to test this. What's that? Focus now. Seven of 17. What could that mean? Anyway, looks like a Zenith. I wonder if it's the original. 23 BC EP22. Not sure. What is that? I'll have to see if I can find something out on that. I don't know. Month? Day? Month? I'm not sure. Interesting now. Hopefully it won't be too hard to get the color thing figured out. Oh. Sure like to use this. X-ray precaution. Absolute masterpiece though. Man, this thing is just beautiful. I love it. it looks like the chassis swings down for service. Probably take that out and that'll swing down, won't it? Well, let's test the CRT out. It's all dirty in there, ain't it? Hmm. Give it a little go go lick here. can't really tell. Well, brought up this thing, so let me get this wired up to her and see how that picture tube looks. All right, got her hooked up. Let's see what we got. Just got to turn around and set the filament. Globin. All right. That's good. That's good. Cut off. Well, that seems all right, huh? Let's go back here. Starting to warm up. Let's not overdo her here. Let me out. She's waking up a little bit. Ooh. Ooh. -hoo. Awesome. Color tracking good. Emissions are seem really good on that. That's nice. Alright. So I need to do that was on red. And that was almost 13 and a half. Let me click on the other one here. Six, seven, and five. All right. And it's coming back alive. Oh, I can hear it. Surprised you can hear that over my ears ringing. Let's 
13. Color track good. So that's really good too. Just a smidge under, it looks like. And that shadow makes it look like I'm over volt, don't it? 11, 12, and 13. Is this thing like hardly used or something? Or a new tube? I don't know. Geez, look at that. They're all about the same. And it's coming up on 13 and a half. It sure is. Wow, I lucked out on this thing, I think. She's just a little filthy. Sitting in an abandoned, what you gonna call it? Huh. I think I luckered out. That's awesome. I love saving the beasties. The Zenith. Chroma Color 2. Fully solid state. Color console television. I also did clean up all the pot controls on the front. On the back. With some uh, cleaner. Contact cleaner. Some of the deoxit and that made all the controls work really well for getting it kind of squared up on the alignment just wanted to but wanted to double check make sure not a loose connection or one of the pots just being dirty causing no color situation but all the easy stuff's been ruled out so there we are I hope I can figure it out we'll see don't know. I think this is over my head. Way overhead for my nude stuff, but maybe not. We'll see. I don't know. So, Sasha, do you think this 70s Zenith matches a 70s carpet? What do you think? Hmm.